Hey guys, my name is Monkey Woe, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the new Bear Alphas update, where it added a new event called the Retro Event, where we can unlock retro-themed skins and also other rewards by just completing puzzles or surviving rounds. So in this video, we're going to be playing a few rounds, trying to grind up some studs, and buying all the new items. I hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you do enjoy, make sure to subscribe and leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. We're aiming for 5,000 subscribers this year. And if we can get that, that would be amazing. Anyways, guys, with no further ado, let's hop into the game. All right, guys, so as you see on the screen, there is a thing called events right here. And if you step on it, you have a whole list of items. You got the social gear slingshot. You got the kill effect studs, which are two things I've actually redeemed uh, when I recorded a video. But there's three other items that we're going to redeem in this video. Um, so right now we have 44 studs. So what we're going to do is actually claim this bear. And there we go. We got skin obby. No way. All right. So that means we're left with 85 studs that we need uh, in total to get the two uh, last rewards. And we can get studs by puzzles, kills, surviving, and also finding studs around the map. That's what we're going to be doing in this video. Alright guys, so for our first round, we are Survivor. And we can actually check out this new social gear. We have the Slingshot social gear. So let me see. Uh, look at this cat right here. Oh yeah, he's going to get hit with all the... Oh, he has a... Oh yeah, he is it. A... Yeah, that, that's very awful. Alright, we have a wire puzzle here. So now, we can complete this wire puzzle. And it's said in the description of the event that if we complete puzzles, we actually get some studs. So let's complete this puzzle and hopefully we can get some studs. So here we go. Let's continue our way. We're going to run around. Oh, we know the color. We just saw that. Uh, red, red, orange. Let's go. Um, I think Unwell is chasing. So no way. No way Unwell didn't see us. Let's keep on going. We had four puzzles done. Let's go. We got. No. No. Dude, I, I forgot the color. It's like red, or red, orange, right? There we go. We got the color puzzle done, which means that we got even more studs for the quest. All right, so now we get another, uh, we get studs by surviving. So we have one minute to survive. So me and my boys over here, Gatito and also Rust Lord over here, uh, we're going to be waiting up here for Bear. Uh-oh, Unwell. I like how Unwell only went for me. That's actually insane. Hey, buddy. All right, so... We should be good because I am absolutely Juke Master 5000. Um, never mind, I'm not Juke Master 5000. Oh my. There's no way I got hit there. Unwell is really adamant of getting us. Unwell, no way. He, he jumped down there. He jumped down there. I just ran into a wall. Dude, Unwell just got his ankles broken. He jumped down. <laughs> he thought I jumped down. Let's go. There we go. Five seconds left, and there we go. Another win in our books. Let's go. 30, there we go. We got 34 studs, which means we can almost afford the almost like second to last reward. All right, so this map has three puzzles we need to complete. We have the color puzzle. I think there's a wire puzzle, and then there's the, uh, the cheese that we need to do. Okay, guys, so right here is the stud. So if we go and uh, press it, and there we go. We got some free studs. That's what it means by finding studs around the map. Basically, there is like a blue, light blue studs that spawn around each map. And once you collect it, you get a few studs by collecting, which is really good. Which means we're finally able to afford that second to last reward and try and finally figure out what that is, which is really cool. It looks like someone did the, someone did two out of three. There's no way. Bear was right there. All right, guys, we're running. Me and Bacon are running. We're running for our lives. Come on, Bacon. Let's go. Let's go, Bacon. Okay, guys. So I found the color code green, green, yellow, green. It's actually on this little plank. So green, green, yellow. All right. Now we have to rush back all the way to this, uh, the main area where the, the hills are. Nine seconds. No. All right. Do this. It was green, green, yellow. So one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And let's go. We completed that puzzle, which means we got even more studs. Dude, I'm pretty sure we got a lot of studs that round because we completed that puzzle and also found studs and also survived. So let's go check how much studs we've got. Also, guys, as you complete the event, there's a little uh, building that actually is being built as you collect more studs. So let's see how it looks like once I buy this. So we have 35 studs, so we could afford this. Let's go. We got the kill effect. Are you in?
All right, guys, so we got the kill effect, and now we have the final skin, which we need 50 studs. So we have 10 studs right now, so we're pretty close. And look, we've act we're actually building something, and we're building a character, which I am super excited to see what happens when we complete it. All right, guys, so we are Survivor, and we're in the new map. I think that this would be good for the video to check out the new map that came with this latest update. So here we go in the new map. The Fresh meat. Huh? So usually the color code spawns right there, but for some reason it didn't uh, spawn there this time. Um, but we have the wire puzzle that spawns here always, so we can complete that as well. Alright guys, we completed that wire puzzle. Let's go. Oh, here is the cheese. Of course, it's by the stable. So now that we can, that we got the cheese, um, we're gonna grab a horse real quick. Because, you know, I mean, we gotta get a horse, guys. It's, it's medieval times. We gotta... Dude, we're the only survivor. Guys, do you think we'll we'll be able to survive? Dude, the, the, the bear might be good. The might... Like, there's a reason, there's a reason I'm the only survivor. Good for us that this place actually has a window for us. Ah! Okay, let's, uh, let's go this way. Doing a little loop. I think we've lost bear. Um, let's go over here. Let's go to the opposite, like, literally the opposite of the, uh, the map. I do not want to run into that bear at all. Alright, so, I'm gonna go to survivor spawn. Okay, I don't know where this guy is. I'm kind of panicking, because I don't know where he is. But we're gonna go up here. Okay, we have 40 seconds left. If we get found by bear, we should be able to juke him. So, why here is, like, a really good middle point, where we could probably see him at all angles. And run the opposite direction. Here we go. Oh, there he is. Let's go. Okay. Here we go. We're gonna go this way. We're gonna use a little bit of sprint. We're gonna climb the ladder. Use a little sprint here too. We have 68 sprint. Um, there we go. We see bear over here. <laughs> well, my my boy, my boy just chilling. Um, let's run a little bit. Okay. We have to make sure we have a good sprint, and we have to look back to see where bear's going. We're gonna go up here. No, I'm just kidding. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna keep this loop. Uh, loops are your best friends in uh, bear. So here we go. With 30 seconds remaining and we have survived another round. Here we go. Let's ride our horse. Let's ride our horse. Let's ride our horse. He's scared of the horse. I should have pulled out the horse earlier. Let's go. Alright guys, so we have 42 studs, which means we only need one more round in order to complete this whole event. Alright guys, so that means we're almost guaranteed if we do if we survive the next round and do like a few puzzles, we're almost guaranteed that we're gonna finish this in the next round. So here we go. Alright guys, so this is our second time playing in this map for this video. Alright, so I pretty much know where all the puzzles are. So I know that the wire puzzle is over here in this direction. Now we have do have to be careful because I think bear might come from that direction. We try to avoid bear at all costs, but Hopefully, there we go. We found the wire puzzle. Let's complete this wire puzzle. Two survives already died is not any special round. It's the classic round, which means that we should be good as long as Bear finds us in like the final minute or so. Okay, we should be good to walk around. And let's jump up here. All oh, yellow, pink, blue. All right, let's go. We saw Bear as well. We need to get Bear out of us to stop chasing. So, um, there you go. That was actually a really good shortcut that, that we did. So what I'm going to do is actually go over here and try to lose him by climbing this ladder. And All right, now that we've lost bear, we're able to go and do the color code. Uh, okay, nice. We've lost bear. So we need yellow, pink, and blue. There we go. And complete this. Nice. We got 1 minute and 40 seconds left. Guys, we can do this. We can do this. Dude, no. There's head legs. Okay, what we can do is wait a little bit. We're going to pretend we're going to jump down. Uh, he did not fall for it. Okay, that's good. It's okay. It's okay. We can complete this cheese altar and we're instant win right here. <gasps> I missed. Let's go. We've completed the puzzle and we can shoot head legs. We can shoot head legs. All right, guys, we have finally completed the event. So let's go over here and complete this event. Let's go. All right, so what I'm going to do is step right here and look at that. We got 52 quids, bro. If we didn't survive, I'm not sure we'll be able to have enough. But guys, we survived and let's go. Here we go. 52 quids. Boom. There we go. We got the skin teapot of doom. What? 
Hold up. I want to equip that instantly. All right, guys. So I am bare. And look at this skin. This is the final reward of this uh, little event pass. And look at it. It looks super cool. The body is made out of studs. And there's teapots going everywhere. And this face is googly eye with teapots. Now, I'm not going to show you guys the stud kill effect. But I am going to show, show you the... He just killed both of them. Are you serious right now? And... Oh, there we go. And it's just the ball. Are you serious? It's just the ball that spawns. No way. Anyways, guys, that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe. That'd be greatly appreciated. And that was a pretty cool retro event uh, that we are able to experience. And look at this. It, they, it, the guy has a sword now. I thought he was going to dance at the end or something. But hey, he just has a sword now. So let's go. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you do want to see week four's update where this event actually released, check out this video on the screen now. And also subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure you tune in for the final week this Friday. The final week of the, the weekly updates is going to be amazing. So make sure you tune in. Anyways, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one.